Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to change the boot order on your computer BIOS. So while this tutorial may be performed on a Windows 11 machine, this tutorial will apply for many earlier versions of Windows, such as Windows 10, Windows 8, Windows 7, and Windows XP, and even Windows Vista. So it should be a pretty straightforward process, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing I'd recommend doing would be to go online and search for your specific computer manufacturer and model if you can and search for boot menu key. So let's say you have like a Dell Inspiron laptop, you would type in Dell Inspiron laptop boot menu key because it could be any key, any function key basically in order to boot into the boot menu. So it could be the escape key F2, F8, F12, for example, and this will vary depending on computer manufacturer and the motherboard settings, so I don't really want to speculate too much. It could also be the escape key, which is in my case. So while the computer is booting up, you want to start tapping that key repeatedly, whatever that key may be. So I'm about to go shut off my computer, and then as the computer is turning on, I'm going to start tapping that key. Okay, so for our boot menu here, you want to go ahead and just scroll down using your arrow keys and select the enter setup option. So now that we're on this menu here, there's a lot of different options you can play around with in the BIOS, even though I normally would not suggest playing around in the BIOS, so that might not have been the best choice of words here, but we're gonna navigate over to the boot tab. So use your, your arrow keys on your keyboard. So just use the right arrow key to go over to boot. And then at this point, you should be able to change the boot order. So you can see values at the bottom of the screen here that allow you to change the order. So by selecting the value, you can just highlight over using your arrow keys so up and down. And then using the plus or minus sign, you can move them up or down in the list. So pretty straightforward. If you want hard drive to be first, you can click the plus sign to move it up to the top. Or you can move it down using the minus sign or subtraction sign. So again, pretty straightforward process there, guys. And once you're done with that, you're just going to tap the F10 key to save and exit. Or you could tap F9 to set up defaults to go back to the default state. Again, that's depending on what you need to do. And if your key is different than what I'm showing, so you can see the bottom of the screen, it tells us what key to press. It may be different in your case, so just be aware of that. Every BIOS is a little bit different, but they all have very similar um, features and functionality, so that shouldn't be too confusing for anybody. So once you're done making any changes here, you're going to go ahead and select the F10 key to save and exit. And it's going to say save configuration changes and exit now. Tap the enter key, which is pretty universal, and that should be about it. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I do apologize to be able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.